It's a raining, friends. Um, saw some bad weather coming, so I had to divert. And uh, I said, well, while I'm here, I might as well get fuel for the hell of it. I didn't really need it, but I think I may have had tank, half tanked or something. So well, let me get some fuel. Might as well, you know. And I've only got like a half hour flight to get back to the normal airport that I'm normally at. Um, but it's nighttime. And uh, it's rain. It just started raining. I saw this band coming on, on the weather radar. So, well, I guess I'll just sit here and, you know, read some of my sites and see what the hell's going on. And, uh, you know, these Twitter trials, again, everything happens for a reason. It's all about timing. The Supreme Court taking the Brunson case again. They're going to rehear, have a rescheduled hearing to, you know, maybe we'll look at it the second time on the 17th. She's only 17. 17. Daddy says she's too young. But she's old enough for me. <laughs> you remember that song? Who was that? Well, that was Warrant. I think Warrant. You see that flash? It's over that way. And it's kind of coming. Uh, I'm catching the edge of it. Hopefully it'll, it looks like it'll pass me in the next half hour or so. But I'll have to sit here and wait. Well, I might as well do a video. So, um, you know, you've seen all this stuff with the Twitter files. They're colluding with the government. The stifle free speech. This guy, Yoel Roth, again, the, this alleged pedo dude. Uh, based on his own comments, I mean, Jesus, if you look at what he said, and, and he had a couple of two or three different accounts on Twitter, and we know that now. He's not denied that. He's basically admitted they're his. And uh, Mar Marjorie Taylor Greene called him out on that, I believe. It was great. Uh, and then the other lady, uh, the dark-haired lady, was uh, grilling him, too. So what are the chances, again, right now that this is coming out, Supreme Court, we might look at this case again. We're go I mean, we're going to. Scheduled for a rehearing on the... 17th what's the 17th letter of the alphabet the letter q is the 17th letter of the alphabet for some strange reason weird number or a letter and number um and again i'm going you know maybe <laughs> maybe it could happen this time and with all this crap coming out about the government how corrupt it is all this stuff it would be a perfect time for the Supreme Court to go, you know what? The whole election thing they're alleging and the government didn't look into it. Now they're colluding with private corporations to stifle free speech. They're spying illegally on people. They're forcing these companies to do illegal stuff and the companies are not even really forcing them, they're complying. If you could see the face, the expression, and, and you can if you'd like to go watch the video, of Yoel Roth of Twitter, former Twitter, getting grilled it looked like that guy was having a panic a, a, what i would like to call a quiet panic attack i mean he's just about to crap his pants right there it was amazing to just watch this but again timing 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 the case in uh Kerry lake's case uh arizona election problems oh that's you know it's going to the appellate court and they're you know we're hoping they'll rule on it really quickly in fe february and uh, it's moved through the ranks. You go again. Are they going to toss it out? Oh, let her go to the state supreme court, and then the state supreme court will say, "Well, let it go to the federal supreme court." You know, I don't know how that's going to go. I mean, you know, if I had the playbook, I'd love to tell you. Uh, it's just you know speculation. But if you're watching Entheos and Tori Morris and all them, uh, looks like the plan's in motion. I mean, if you can't see stuff happening, you know, I'm going to say you're blind right now. Um, again, timing, timing, timing. It's just, how does this end, and, and is it soon? I don't know, but uh, I figured I'd do a little quick video for you. And uh, on that note, take it easy. Remember, if you ever see comments on the YouTube, hey, it's Jay Snip, go here, call me, uh, WhatsApp. This, it's not me. I don't do that. I don't ever contact you or reply to you telling you to contact me. It ain't me. It's a scammer if they do it. Just FYI. So on that note, I'll just sit here in my sorrows of the darkness and... Hello, darkness rain, my old friend. You're sitting in the airport waiting for the rain to pass by again. And if Bitcoin went to 30k... Um, speaking of which, again, if all this stuff starts going happening, mainly Supreme Court stuff... 
and the Congress members we talked about are actually removed. Do you really think that would be positive for the crypto market, the stock market, any, any and all markets? That would be news that would cause stuff to just freaking tank, in my opinion. But who am I, you know, old snippy. Oh, and I said, <laughs> well, I think a video's coming later from Jean-Claude, but me and somebody were eating lunch. <laughs> Jay Snip, someone walks up, Jay Snip. <laughs> I'm like, come on. No way. And then the other day, like this is a few weeks, a couple, throughout three weeks ago, I'm in the airplane for my, doing the private pilot, you know, I still got my check ride schedule. I had to reschedule, reschedule. Um, and I'm waiting for my CFI to come out. We're about to go for a flight. So I'm just sitting in there, little windows open. I see one of the ladies from the office coming up and a, and a man and a woman coming up with them. And they're like looking at the plane and stuff. And I'm like, oh, I guess maybe they're looking at it to rent it or, rent it or something. The guy walks right up. Jay Snip. <laughs> like, I'm sitting in what they call the ramp where you park an airplane and you tie it down and that kind of thing. What are the chances that somebody that happened to know me through YouTube, which I, of course I don't know you guys, I never see you, but you see me and you know me, is walking up to look at this plane that I'm essentially renting while I train in it from the same company, the guys that tra that training me. And then this you know stranger walks up with the, i don't know if it was his wife or his friend i didn't think he said it was his wife but nonetheless they both knew me like we watched you we watched you. I'm, I'm sitting here alone in this plane you mean to tell me you're coming to look out the one plane to rent it maybe rent it in all the airports around here and everything and i just have to be sitting in it waiting to go give me a break and then today i'm eating lunch in an area kind of far from here you know still in florida that's why i was flying and someone walks up, husband and wife, Jay Snip. <laughs> come, come on, man. So anyways, let's see what happens. I gotta wait for this weather to clear. It's, I think it's getting close, but we'll see. Take it easy.